Hey baby dolls, so I'm just getting back from the farmer's market and I thought I would show you what I picked up this week. I really wanted to film when I was in there, but I was just so overwhelmed that the farmer's market is just really an amazing, eclectic flavors of meats and cheeses and breads and spices and juices. It's just overwhelming, even facial stuff. So um, next time I go, I'm going to definitely try to film for y'all. But let's go ahead and get into what I found this week at the farmer's market. So I went over to like the little utensil area and I did want to get some really fun chopsticks. So these are the bamboo chopsticks and it looks like you get five pair and I paid $1.50 and they're just so cute. I'll probably bring them up closer for you in another haul later. But yeah, I got some chopsticks. I went ahead and got some Vietnamese seasonings. This is by this company. And um, right here is where you look and see what kind of like flavors are in it. So this says Oriental Spices for Catfish Paste. Oh my gosh, so this is definitely something that you can put in. Um, look, they even have a crock pot here. It looks like they're wanting you to use this for seafood. So I thought this was really good. And I love to try these little things because they're just a dollar. And so I got that one. And then I got this flavoring here. It looks like they're saying by the picture to use it with beef. You don't have to use it with beef, but I'm gonna definitely do that. And then I got two of these. These are bouillons, but I've never seen anything like this. This is blue crab bouillon. You know, a lot of times we see the chicken bouillon or the beef bouillon, but never have I ever seen blue crab flavored. And I am gonna be making some soups this weekend. So I do plan on adding this into probably one of my Asian soups. I'm probably gonna do an Asian soup, an African soup, and an Indian soup. And so, yeah. And then I went ahead and got a package of neck bones. And so I just really, I we really do love neck bones here. Um, but what we do is we put them in the air fryer. So the meat gets nice and tender and a little crunchy. And then to have like a couple of neck bones with say a bowl of whatever variety soup we choose is really a good look. It's really, really good. So this was $8. For that and then they had a special on ground beef now i typically don't get ground beef but since we're trying to do some different types of dieting um ground beef is one of the things that you can have and so you got i got this big thing of ground beef for five bucks so i went ahead and got two of them and this is gonna all of this stuff is gonna the meat portion is gonna last us definitely about a month and i'm gonna show you why um i got a can of corned beef this is really, really good stuff. And the way that I prepare it, I do it, uh, put it in rice. It's an African dish called jollof rice. And it is so good. I got a thing of cabbage and some cauliflower. So the cabbage was like $2.50. The cauliflower was $1.99. Um, we're going to be cooking out for Super Bowl Sunday this weekend. So I went ahead and got a big old slab of pork ribs, and I thought this was a really good price. It was eight bucks for this big slab of ribs. So I'm gonna season and actually clean this up with vinegar and season it really good tomorrow, which is gonna be Saturday. And then it'll be good and marinated for Super Bowl Sunday. In addition to Super Bowl Sunday, we're gonna have a couple of ribeye steaks. And normally this is like 12, 13 bucks, but they were on special today. So I went ahead and purchased one of them. Um, one pack, so one steak each for that. It looks like it's just kind of splitting, spreading a little bit there, but that's fine. All right, so I got that. And then this is what I love to use in my soups, girls. This is smoked turkey wings. It is so good. It flavors your food so nice. I'm gonna definitely be putting this in one of my soups. I'm thinking one of my, I think I'm gonna do it in the Asian soup. And I got some, uh, I was gonna say Brussels sprouts. Lord have mercy. Y'all know what these are, bean sprouts. I'm gonna put this on top of my soup whenever I get it done. And so that's gonna be so divine. I love bean sprouts so much. You get this whole thing for like $1.50. Um, I did get a yucca root. I love to put this in one of my stews, probably one of my curried stews that I'm gonna do. And then I got, they had a big sale on chicken legs today. 
So this whole big thing of chicken legs is five bucks. It's gigantic. I mean, it's I mean, it's really, really heavy. I don't know how many pounds it is, but it was like 49 cents a pound. And so I'm gonna definitely, I'm gonna clean them and then I'm gonna separate them and put them in the freezer. And then this is just something special, um, a special treat. I love to try to drink these different little drinks. And this is a multivitamin kind of cocktail, but it doesn't have any alcohol in it, but I just love the color. And I thought it looked so good. And look at all those different fruits and things here. So I can't wait to try that. No preservatives, it says. So this is a healthier alternative to some of the drinks. And so I went ahead and got two of those. And then they have these. These look so good. This is by this company called Grace. And Grace is used a lot in the Caribbean. This is like one of their brands that they use a lot and this one is the lychee paradise and look at all those different fruits so this was on sale normally this is a dollar fifty but they were on sale for 99 cents today so i got the lychee paradise and then i got the pineapple guava they are so pretty i love the color and then this one is the sorrel ginger this is really really popular in jamaica when you go over there this is like one of their drinks that they make homemade. This has this tastes nothing like it does over in the islands, but you know, it just kind of gives you like that little hint of memory. And so, yeah, I got those for 99 cents. And then also, um, I got some things at the Dollar General and I'm tired of washing dishes. <laughs> and so this weekend we're gonna be using some cutlery, so. I love the color gold, so I went ahead and got two packages of that. And then the foam paper plates were just a dollar. The cutlery was just a dollar too. Something different, you know, from going for, to the Dollar Tree all the time. And then let's come over here a little bit. Um, also, I couldn't believe it, um, they had some fabric softener. And this fabric, fabric softener smells really, really good. I do use it a lot. I just never have used this particular scent. And so this is supposed to be really, really good. So this was normally $5.99, but I got it for $4.99. Can't wait to use that. And then this is what I couldn't believe. They had some Lysol. Lysol, and it was like five bucks for a, you know, a regular size thing of Lysol. And then also what I could not believe is they had some rose water. And this is great for the skin. This is actually a water spray. And I use this sometimes to do, um, you know, once I put my powder makeup on, I will spritz it with some, my, I will spritz my face with something like this so it gives you that, that nice little glow so you're not really like a cake face. So yeah, this was $1.50. So I'll let you know what I think about that. And then they also had some imitation skin cream. Uh, by Modessa. This is the imitation of Noxzema, and I love using this to take my makeup off. So I ended up spending about, I think it was like around, it was $80 for all this stuff. And so, yeah, I hope that y'all have enjoyed the time that I, we have spent together. I'm really excited about this weekend and fixing some different foods. And so leave me a comment down below. What are you doing this weekend? How are you doing? What you cooking? What are you doing? And I will see you in the next video. I love you, but God loves you so much more. Remember that pretty is as pretty as it is. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.